Hello. In today's video, I'd like to talk about how to change your state. Do you ever start your day out really good? And then all of a sudden you start to feel it getting heavier and heavier and heavier. Somewhere along the way, you've made a choice about something or you've witnessed something that you've allowed to affect you. And it's starting to change your vibration. It's starting to weigh it down. It's starting to go down into the lower frequencies and things down there don't feel as good. And uh, the last thing that you want is for law of attraction to meet you in those lower vibrations because law of attraction has one rule and it's called like attracts like. So wherever you are in your vibe, law of attraction is going to bring you more of the same in the form of people or events or whatever. That's law of attraction. It's what, uh, like attracts like. So when you change your state, the one way to do that is to just immediately go and do something different. And preferably you're going to pick something that you enjoy. I don't know what that might be for you, but for me, going out into nature immediately uplifts my vibration. Listening to the type of music that I like uplifts my vibration. Um, you know, maybe it's someone who is uh, a good feeling person and I go spend time with them, have coffee, drinks, food, whatever. That also is a way that I personally can lift my vibe. So what's important is, is you don't keep heading in the direction of those choices that you made that cause your vibration to, you know, go or down, go down into the lower frequencies. Um, it's important that you uh, break that state. And so imagine if you have a toolbox and it's full of choices and those choices are in the form of tools. Which one of those tools could you pick up when you look at that toolbox? Which one has the best feeling, the best feeling tool that you could put your hand on and run with that to get your vibration back up? So, you know, doing art, doing exercise, meditating, all, all those things, whatever it is for you that makes you feel good, that's called uh, a state change. And, um, you, you know, change your state of mind, change your state of being, it's all the same thing. So. It happens to all of us. For me, I've got a lot of amazing things that I've created in my life that are going uh, great. And then, uh, you know, the future things that, uh, you know, as I look forward, uh, I, I generate a, a great positive feeling from. But we all have these days. So today for me personally, um, I needed to change my state. And so here I am, I came out for a walk in this beautiful nature. I've got uh, waterfall sounds behind me. I've got a big lake in front of me. And I hear all the, the animals out here in, in the wild with uh, nature. I also hear car traffic, but um, that doesn't bother me. Anyway, um, I wanted to change my state. So here I am going for a little nature walk. I've got a lot of things on my list that I want to accomplish today, but the, the direction I was going, it wasn't, uh, I wasn't in the right state of mind. And that's really important because anything you do in life, you want to be in optimal state. Imagine if law of attraction is like attract like, and you're trying to push through with a bad feeling, you know, a lower frequency, lower vibration, lower state of mind. Law of attraction is gonna meet you there in every phone call you make, every meeting you have, everything you encounter. So uh, I place the utmost importance on being aware enough to say, I need to change my state right now because I don't want anything that I have to do from here forward not to come out with the utmost optimal, you know, outcome that benefits me and, you know, whatever projects I'm doing or, or my family. So it's important that you, you know, go sit down, meditate, go out for a walk, go do some art, whatever is in that toolbox of feelings, those tools that you could pick up, what's the best feeling tool that you could pick up and change your state? Get yourself back to that higher vibration, that optimal, you know, frequency that feels amazing to you. Law of attraction is gonna come meet you there and then everything's gonna flow. Just just since um, I, I did meditate, um, that felt amazing. I, and uh, just as soon as I finished meditating, probably even before I could hear my phone starting to, to ding you know, text message were coming in, messages uh, from people were coming in, uh, you know, for various different reasons, but all positive and good things. That's how fast this happens. If you just keep your vibration high, you're going to attract so many amazing things to you. If you feel that dipping down, you, you saw something, it affected you. You heard something, it affected you. If you feel yourself dipping down, grab control, 
You are the creator of your reality. You only witness the things that you give power to and believe in. Grab control, get yourself back up to a high vibration and watch the beauty will continue to flow. And that's what I'm doing for myself personally here is making sure that I am in the, the, the highest state of vibration that I can be in as I then continue with the rest of my day because I want the best outcome. So there you are, state change. St change your state of mind, your state of being, get yourself back up to a high vibration and watch how beautiful that will be for you. Law of Attraction is gonna meet you wherever you are, preferably you, are, you want it to meet you at a high vibration. All right, have a good one.